Hello, hello, welcome to Red Ted Art. First thing, sir, subscribe to the channel now. Hit that subscribe button. And obviously you can hit the like button too whilst you're at it. Now today we're gonna to show you how to make these super cute little, oh, I've got a different drawing on this side. Cute little whales. I was sort of trying out my different designs. What you will need is an A4 sheet of blue paper cut in half, so this is your A5. And out of this, you'll be able to make a mummy and two babies. Um, so keep the little, um, cut away in a minute so what we'll do is we'll bring up this corner to make a triangle uh, to uh, make a triangle which we can then turn into a square so here we go oh of course you can start off with a square piece of origami paper i think this is roughly 12 centimeters by 12 i'm not sure i think it's 10 so keep this perfect for the little babies so you now have your your triangle you open it up again you bring this straight line and line it up in the middle like so it gets a bit so at the top it's easy but at the bottom it gets a bit trickier so you just need to be a bit more careful do it as neat as you can nice neat crease turn it around and do the other side so it looks a bit like a kite now just because when we do the tail it's easier if you now fold this like this you want to you make want to make this crease that you've made go in both directions okay so all i'm doing is unfolding folding unfolding folding so that the crease goes in both directions now I bring down this tip and create another little sort of triangle and this line is straight with this line yeah so this is lined up with this fold it over and there you have your basic sort of standing shape now you want to make the tail so you take your bottom bit and you fold it up now with right angles so you want to have a straight line here going at a right angle here it doesn't matter too much if it's exactly right angle or not but it helps if this is a right angle down there now give this a nice crease and then again wiggle it in both directions crease 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 because now what we want to do is we want to open it and gently push the tail to fold in the opposite direction so that's all those creases that we've done okay so look we opened it, I've pushed it, and I'm pushing the crease in, okay? Because then all those creases we've done will help that tail just pop into place. Now what you need is your little scissors. I know that makes it technically kirigami, because if there's any cutting involved, it's no longer origami, but kirigami. Fold these down, draw a little face, and you're done. Now, my ones, just because I happen to see this little piece of pink paper lying around, I decided to cut out a little circle and stick it on, but of course you don't have to do that. I'm just gonna do that because I can, and it was lying there, the pink paper, and I thought, wow, doesn't that look cute? And that's how simple it is to make a little paper whale. Now you could use these as play settings at a party or at a um, you know th fish under the sea themed thing at school. You could make a little mobile out of them. You could play with them, have them as little toys. And that's it, really. Really easy peasy, cute, cute, cute little whale. Now, if you like this video, don't forget to give it the thumbs up. Please comment below, tell me more of what you'd like to see. And of course, of course, tell all your friends about Red Ted Art. Now, thanks for all your support and for watching and all that kind of stuff. And hopefully see you here again soon. Bye.